have you returned? You are not done yet. How did you know where to find this? He has shown me. You haven't told me what you want in return. Only that you learn what you are truly capable of. Find an orc leader, make him a war chief, and all his soldiers will be yours. But where am I to lead this army of mine? Bring them to me, and I will show you. Marwan said to bring her an army. We shall not build an army. We shall command one. We'll need to find an Uruk captain to dominate and make our own. There is a slave near here named Grublik. We will make him serve our cause. Where there are slaves to be tortured, we will find this captain. Oi! Tell us again about how you killed that range of filth. Shut your face! I ain't giving you the satisfaction! If you killed him, how come he killed a bunch of us just yesterday? Cause he's a ghost! You kill him and he just comes back. You see you. Nani here, Gelar Mordor. Back for us all. of the river Unwin, by the color so many These tribesmen are desperate. They will do anything to resist the Uruks. I fear Lithariel will never surrender. Her honor will doom them all. Thank you. 
An idle slave is a dead one! Grublik. been missing since the orcs came. Do you suppose she escaped? I would not give up hope. I'm hearing things! Anything was ever there. Well, that was worth the effort. Fight for me! He's ours. We must now make this captain a bodyguard, if he is ever to be a war chief. It is from First Strike of Thunder that is soon born a storm. The 
must help our puppet before they cut his strings. Bleed for me! Our protege wields fear like a weapon, and we are his invisible ally. A shadow who stays close and sees all. That is the Elven way. fights for us well. Through my will, he steers these Uruks of Mordor. You serve the Bright Master! Need to assist in the fight. I conquered the weak. Now join me in victory. Any who oppose me will pay with their blood. To red swords. Hail our captain. May we die last. We fight for true Uruk! Now that we have our hunter, let us stalk our prey. Our captain. Then he has chosen death. A great advantage will ready us for this battle. Next one I see, I'm gonna learn to ride it! You should be afraid of him! 
Just one of them could tear you apart! Can you believe that baker stared outside in his wretched heat all day long? Rich? Only thing wretched out here is your complaint! <laughs> savage beasts, and we shall harness and command their savagery. Nothing better than seeing a pig for wailing for mercy. That's why it's better to kill the pigskins when you got a bit of an audience. Even his odds. It's a cannibal. Be cautious. Our pawn must not be sacrificed. Picking. 
better world now. Chaos will reign. plan has given us great strength. Strength should not be squandered, but wielded. The Queen will show us how. Marwyn's strategy yields great results. An army of our own to face darkness head on. A mirror looking upon itself, ready to be cracked. We should return to Marwyn. She will have more for us. Powerful wizard. Talion, I am sorry. Saruman brought you here against my will. I went to him for help. I ended up being a prisoner within my own body. What have you seen in your visions? I have seen Sauron's servants, the tower, and the black hand. They bring much suffering. If you wish to know where they are, they are across the Sea of Nanan. Their forces. How strong? Strong enough to defeat us all. Then we truly will need an army. Illness still plagues you. Rest, Mother. I will make preparations for our journey out of Mordor. Saruman is one of the Istari. With the power of the Ring, he could have built a great army to challenge the Dark Lord. And that's what we must do. The one garrison does not an army make. Yes. We must dominate more war chiefs for a true army.
off by my wee scars. Oh, not at all. I actually have a few of my own. <laughs> oh, I'll bet. What type of battle scars did you get from the Black Gate, eh? Splinters! <laughs> oh, or did you uh, scar your voice telling your soldiers to head into battle? Tread lightly. My scars run very deep. Huh. The mighty Grog. You give me these. And he also... took my hunting partner. So, what now? Well, another lesson for you, my captain. <clears throat> Maybe you'll even come out of this one on Scar. <laughs> So, what backward lesson do you have planned this time, eh? Shooting Crabane to prepare us for the mighty Grog? If you wanna hunt Grog, then so you shall. But not just any Grog. This is a rare one. It's territorial, strong enough to claim land as its own. And you and me, we're trespassing. Tell me, Captain, you ever slay a Grog before? Today will be the first of many. Now you're talking like a hunter. I've got a feeling in my gut you may survive this, Captain. Well, since that's the largest part of you, I like those odds. So I assume you have a plan to kill this Grog? I do, Captain. And since you're so good at taking orders, I'll tell you how, step by step. Step one, when he's crunching on an Uruk, sneak up behind the giant beast and bleed the bastard's ankle. But why not his throat? There is one place Graugs aren't covered in spiky scales. They don't call a weakness a Graugs heel for nothing! You want me to sidle up to this beast? If you can manage it without being crushed, yes! There it goes! What a fine, fine specimen! And it'll meet a fine end. <laughs> <laughs> 